So, <clears throat> quick repeat of the <laughs> opening announcements, which I did to the preview, OBS preview, that was brilliant. Brilliant, monkey. Okay, let's get some background music here or something. All right, that um, Okay, <laughs> you are tuned into a Master Monkey presentation tonight. It's uh, the loudest battery powered show on Earth. Uh, 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 <laughs> that. I got some quick. I had some greets. I did them, actually. I did them, but I was on preview, so I, I don't know. Okay, Johnny Durden's. I, I dropped by this channel, Johnny Durden's channel. You should check him out. The guy's hilarious. <coughs> and uh, there were some rather interesting types in there playing some pretty crazy punk rock type stuff. And anyways, you're going you're gonna to catch some of that in tonight's show. Uh, greets out to... Honestly, everybody, I lost my I lost my greet list. I already did the greets. Uh, greets out to my lurkers. I love you guys. You're my favorite. As you know, you're my favorite viewers. You're low maintenance. <laughs> I love that. Uh, as always, you can write me, lofi monkey at gmail.com, L-O-F-I monkey. Um, we, got, uh, we got lots of fun playing for our... You didn't see the pumpkin because we missed that part, so... Happy Halloween. We got the pumpkin, of course. I hope you guys caught uh, the uh, one of the performances of Dracula for webcam, directed by Master Monkey. Uh, if not, we're running that through Halloween, or at least through the day before Halloween. Halloween's going to be busy. Um, and you should catch a presentation of it. You can also find it on YouTube, and it's making the rounds around. It's pretty freaking hilarious. We got uh, Act 1 and uh, probably got enough footage for Act 1. Now we're going to do Act 2 and Act 3. By the way, if you're bored tonight after the show, you should stick around. I, I think, well, you might stick around. I, I might be working on Act 2, kind of testing out camera angles and stuff like that. Quickly introduce you to our host, Cowboy Mike, who, as you can see, has undergone a psychedelic makeover like the rest of the show. Cowboy Mike is in charge of keeping us from cussing on the microphone, but we don't do that much anymore, so he's kind of superfluous. He has given up the search for the girl with an A. That's a long insight for you long-timers. That has a fair of long-timers. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can do this again. Man, it's, pretty, it's going to be a completely different thing. Um, all right, let's make some, let's make some noise. That's weird. I just did for the to 15 opening minutes. I'll throw it off here. Let's start with a different instrument. We're going to start with the Casio this time. Wait, don't we always start with the Casio? Okay, here we go. Strap yourself in, kids. We're going to have some sort of time. I don't know. I already did the show opening, which, you know, is a, uh, I like to put a lot of fireworks in it. And, man, there was total fireworks. I was like, I'm going to have to review this afterwards. Sorry about that. I'm going to have to review this afterwards and find out if we've invented a brand new genre. Because it was like total sampler metal punk. It was the weirdest crap. Anyways, here we go. Let's try and invent it again. What do you say, Cowboy Mike? He's going to help us. Welcome, everybody. Uh, thanks a lot for tuning in. Here we go. Hello. Welcome to Die Master Monkey. Thank you.
Hello. Welcome to Die Master Monkey. Thank you.
That's in a test rehearsal of Pitch and Make the Cool Mate Kool Aid uh, by the Johnny Durden's remix, remix by Monkey After Monkey. <laughs> so, no, that's not me on any of it. It's so the Johnny Durden's. Check out his channel, Johnny Durden. It's hilarious. Okay. Uh, I owe you guys a little bit. Uh, um, then I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a break. So give me like five, ten minutes here. And we'll kick some more stuff, and I think I got something I want to explore in that last sample. <laughs> Oh, 
part twice I think I was mentioning before I uh, hope you guys really enjoyed that sort of um, I don't know what that was I really don't I don't know what we're talking about here punk remix avant <laughs> guard smash up of country punk I don't know anyways uh, if you want to if you want to extend your appreciation for that those sounds talk to uh, Johnny Jordan check out his channel Johnny Jordan's uh, channel on Twitch and it's hilarious and I had a really good time just stopped in there and and uh, they're real nice they let me have some of their <laughs> let me have some of their crazy sauce by the way any of you out there are always welcome to any of my crazy sauce you just take it sample it I don't care tape it turn it backwards inside out I don't care whatever man and uh, money's just dirty paper kids remember that so anyways the monkey's gonna take himself a five minute break and uh, the Halloween show here. I'm going to find you something to auto uh, entertain your ears, and we'll be right back. Thank you for tuning in, and stay tuned for even more crazy sauce. I got like three more banks we haven't even played with yet. So here we go. I can't find my card. This, this says I'll be back in five minutes. All right, you guys, this, uh, there we go. Apes was going to tell you guys that I'm going to break. I'm coming back in five. Yeah. Back in five. Thank you. 
Okay, let's not use Instagram uh, 15 second clips for old music again. Oops. And let's not move the mic stand when it's mic'd again. Okay, hello. <laughs> if there's anybody left. Oh my goodness, this is one of the roughest. This is one of the roughest shows. You know what that means? It's probably going to be freaking great. The last show that crashed halfway through, it was one of the best shows. I think it was like 1020. You guys should check out there. Maybe it was 1024. Just watch them all. Go to YouTube and watch them all. Um, okay. Uh, new set. I got a bunch, actually. I have several that you guys haven't seen yet. I'm going to be whipping them out in the next few days or something before Halloween. If you uh, like it or you hate it, send me an email lofi monkey l-o-f-i monkey at gmail.com uh, <laughs> you could send your death threats there but they, they usually just seem like greetings I wonder why did this person send me an email that just says die master monkey yeah that's my name did you have something to say brother okay um did you guys enjoy that uh, that? I was talking and using the pads at the same time. Oh my God. I've often wondered what could happen if I could do this and that at the same time. What would happen? Can't really though, huh? You guys can hear the pads. Okay, so I want to explain to any pad bangers out there uh, my six key. My six key, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, the six pad. Man, the sucker does not come back. If you've seen the way I use this, I double on the six pad. See, so I'm using two fingers on one. Fat lady, come on, get out of the way. I mean, I love her, but. Okay, see, see me doubling on the, see? Hitting it with both fingers. I kind of hit the edges, actually, like the corners, because it's so freaking small. It's only 18 millimeters. Way smaller than the MPC, by the way. I don't know. Wow, this is crazy. Look, Mom. <laughs> you guys think I should ditch that? It's nasty, huh? Yeah. It's gone. Anyways, six keys wearing out. It doesn't. Uh, it doesn't spring back anymore. I got the. Oh no, there's nothing on that key. Ooh, that's harsh. got the thing like August 20th, Roland. So, of course, <laughs> things probably been already been hit more times than any other six key in the history of SPs. see my hands much anymore. I've been playing with like gimmick ideas and stuff just for the hell of it. I thought wouldn't it be funny if like I was using my one hand to hit my other hand down instead. That'd be funny. It doesn't work very well. I saw a guy on I saw a guy on Twitter who had one pad with three fingers like this. Bam, bam, like that so you could do a triplet or something. Did it really fast. I'm like, those are NPCs. See, pads, I think are like almost 30 millimeters. Somebody tell me. Anyways, back to the music. Stay tuned. We're going to make lots of crazy noises and we're going to get the Casio booted up again. We're going to put some stuff in there. That's kind of my go to when it comes to getting inspired. So you'll see how that pro whole process works. Let's go. It's a 
regular set there now. Actually, I know I got a couple of you. So uh, you guys know what that sound means. That, that's the our end of the night song. A uh, little bit melancholy, but uh, a little bit hopeful because we know we'll be back. And I know you'll be back too. Did I just rip off from Mr. Rogers? I might well have. I hope you S SP brethren were paying attention to that last bit there. I know the lights are all screwy and stuff, but you can see the ones that are lit up. If you were, uh, I actually gave an extremely explicit demonstration of how to use the uh, re-trigger trick and uh, how you can use that to sort of make it seem like you got more polyphony than you really do if you hop around the keys a lot. And that's just on a 202 there, right? So, so that's when I was doing this double thing here, right? So go back and review my old videos. I cover all of that stuff in a couple of them. I'll try to, like I said, I'll try to compile this stuff into one SP Tips video, but that's what I was doing. That's how I'm re-triggering that, that guy. See, like that. Because without that trick, you got to do this. And you can't do the re-trigger like you do on a 404. To do that, you got to review my old videos. <laughs> it's all in there, man. You can go as fast as you want. You just got to use that thing there. I wonder how fast I could go. I don't know. It's, he's retired. We probably don't want to. We need to take care of this guy. He's, uh, he's vintage. Vintage. We love that. Oh, which reminds me. Uh, you you got to get new album, Green Dutch. <coughs> Sorry, Green Dutch's new album, Brotherhood of the SP202. If you're lo-fi, all that kind of stuff, go get it at your fun retailers uh, or Bandcamp, I think, actually, Bandcamp. Anyways, thank you for tuning in. I uh, really do love you guys. Uh, keep the cards and letters coming. No, I'm kidding. Uh, don't, don't send me anything in the mail. But you can send me an email anytime you want, lofamonkey at gmail.com. Uh, I couldn't get that uh, Master Monkey because I'm an asshole registered it before me. So, anyways, lofamonkey at gmail.com, and uh, I'm looking forward to you. Next visit, next show is Monday night, midnight, for Drone Sonia. Oh, Drone Sonia. For Drone Sonia. I can't remember. Anyways. And uh, that's got a different set. It's different visuals all the time. You know, people will tell you this stuff's changing up all the time, and it's crazy. Oh, I want a special thanks, of course, to uh, Johnny Durden, or whatever the name of those people in there. That was some crazy stuff. That's where we got the, uh, <laughs> the Kool-Aid song. <laughs> Kool song remix. I I'll get some official credits for them up on the thing. They, they, I got permission, trust me. But, but I didn't think they. I don't think they knew quite what I was going to do. Okay. I love you guys. Stay cool. Stay true. Stay low. See you next time.